guys, what's up? This is Sleeping Giant. I'm back with another review slash survival demonstration for you. Today I'm going to be doing um, a trap. So if you're stuck in the woods and you need to set traps, this one's a simple one. Um, and then I am going to be, these are the things that you're going to be needing um, to make this if you have it. I've got some tarred bank line, but you can do paracord as well. Um, I got my Eversaw. Any saw will do. This is just the one I happen to be using today. And then I have my LT right um, out back. Um, this is my new survival knife, bushcrafting type knife. I got it because it has nice big handle on it for my hands. It's made for guys with big hands, I think, because it's really comfortable. But it has that sharp 90 degree spine on it, scan D grind. Is very nice. It's got a matte black canvas micarta handle on it. And that come I bought it separate, but it comes with a little fire steel that goes right on the sheath. It's a really nice sheath. But uh yeah, so right here's the trap that you'll be doing. Um just a couple things that you'll need. You'll go about halfway into uh it's about inch and a half, inch and a half thick piece of wood. You'll go half, cut halfway through, take your knife and baton through the middle, like right here. Get a chunk of piece off just like that. Um, have it look like this. You're gonna need another piece that's like this, on this size, about two, two and a half feet. And I'll get going on the demonstration or how to make it in just a second here. So, all right, I'll see you in a minute when we get back in the woods. All right, bye. Alright guys, we're back over here in the woods. Um, we're gonna get, set this trap that we were just talking about. Um, first, you're gonna take this part here that I cut off and you're gonna put through like this and then you're gonna twist. And you're gonna keep twisting till it's pretty tight. Um, it needs to have that force behind it. It's just taking a minute. It's got to, this side's got to reach the tree over here before it starts to tighten here. Um, yeah, hold on. One, it should be starting to get a little tight. So I'll show you here what I've done. We are going, we got the bank line and we've wrapped it around a couple times and you'll stick that uh, log part of the um, stick that I cut in half down here in there and you'll twist it until it's tight. You will take the stick, the longer two and a half foot stick here. You're gonna put it there and let this rest on it. The bigger stick rests on the smaller, so it stays. On the back side, you're gonna be putting um, like some sticks and stuff to kind of make like a little ramp and like goes up to it here. Like this stick is going up. Um, and you put some bait down and when the rabbit or whatever it is comes and goes to check out the thing, the principle of this is it will club it over the head. So then you can have uh, food for survival. So I am gonna set this off. Yeah, I'll show you what this, the whole concept of this is. Go, the rabbit comes up this ramp and then it will club its head. and knock it out, kill it, most likely kill it. And you'll have dinner, survival situation type thing. So you'll find a pathway, rabbit pathway. And yeah, so right there's the trap. Um, I just wanted to show you guys. So yeah, all right, 
This is Sleeping Giant, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Thank you.